Okay, so here we are at the Triton booth here at Macna, and I'm with Easton, right? Yeah, that's right. And um, can you go over a little bit about what Triton is all about and how your test results are some of the top in yeah. the industry now? No worries. Um, so in a short form, we we actually um, implementing scientific work into you know reef husbandry. We're doing it like 10 years now, so we are an older company from Europe um, and well known over there. We do we just get it into the market and um, in America slowly because what we do is like very very scientific so you can explain whatever you know part of it which the people are normally not used to we know that from from the um, from other countries like and it's like the last country we're really getting right now you know the product in and then um, it's quite working well so what what we do actually is you have um, every product that, that we use, you, you know why you use it, right? We don't do water change, that's something that really hyped it in the beginning, mm -hmm. but again, it's it's just like, and um, we have reasons for that, right? It's not like we just say, ah, we don't water change, we sell the product, right? right. So uh, people like, we really like that kind of transparency that we that we give them, we have talks, we have, a, you know, we have faces, like you can ask us, you can ask me, Tim and everybody, and um, we have a good support. The problem that people might have is that the information that we have is impressive. You know, so we have 100,000 tests carried out worldwide. We have 16,000 people online. Um, and the database is the biggest in history of reef keeping. So the information that you can get out of it, and make it easy for somebody that is a beginner, for example, is really like critical mass, you could say, you know. and. Um, that's what the beauty to it is, you know, we're not forcing anybody doing everything Triton or something. You just choose whatever tool you like and you think is good for you and you, you know, you use it and your tank will get better. But if you have problems to solve any problem that you have in a tank, you always have something that will work for you. So you just ask, you say like, okay, we need this, we need that. And, um, you know, I, I don't get my zinc right, so we have zinc and you add it. You add it singly, what the people really like is that, you, um, that you're not selling everything in one bottle, you just buy whatever you need. And um, what actually the people in America really like is that we're shifting the power like from the industry to the customer. So before that you would be ruled by us, right, the industry, because you can't like somehow control what we do. But with a testing service like ours, that you know, we—I mean, we have four laboratories in the world. Um, you can, you know, control us. So if we would sell you salt, you would just mix it up in a, bu you know, in a bucket and then send it back to us. And if there would be, you know, contamination in there, something bad for your tank, you would find out through our own tests. This is something that makes that builds trust for for the customers, and that's something that I hear very often when people are talking to me that they really like that. On the other side, sure, um, my colleagues in the industry don't like that, yeah. you know, but that's the way it works. So they, that's what we do actually in a nutshell, very scientific work, and that's what we do. Hobbyists, we're checking calcium, alkalinity, yeah, right. magnesium, um, but when you send your water in to be tested through Triton, you get so much more. Yeah. So how, uh, how is that important? To get to have so much more than just those three. Yeah. So let me explain like that. So before, that's old school reef keeping, right? So this is the, the big difference between uh, the modern reef keeper and the old school reef keeper, right? And the, we call that the modern reef keeping movement, right? It's something that that when we started 10 years ago, it keep rolling and rolling. Now it's really big. And um, what it makes with, with, with the difference is 6.8%. That's what what actually old school reef keeper would measure 
and 99.8% of what we measure. Uh, so 93% of more knowledge is actually a lot. Then there is no problem to it, it's just beneficial because you can find things that make problems in your tank. If you imagine, um, if I ask people saying like, how do you know you do a good job or a bad job in a tank, right? The most people will say, yeah, I'm doing a good job when my tank looks good and I'm doing a bad job when I die, you know, when the animals die. And uh, even for that, like a technology like lab testing is, is very helpful because you have something in between, you know, that tells you, look, it, it could start dying, do something, right? Um, and there are a million of other possibilities that come in with, with this um, technology, like the framework, the standard framework that we have, the Triton method, that, you know, it's a super easy guideline for people that just want to have a nice tank, right? But for us, is a framework to do research on, so we can target produce like uh, products that go on with that method. It's, it's not possible to produce a targeted product for a modular system. Like you'd never know what the people are doing, like you know, for filtration or this is not going to work. And and you know, the reef keeping is 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 getting like a bit adult, you would say. You know, like um, we're growing up from from being kids to you know, and. Um, now people are asking questions like how can it work if you add 10 milliliters of something into a 100 gallon tank uh, and my tank is one fish and the other tank is is a really big coral reef you know it's, just, it's not really you know logical or why do i do 10 percent water change and um you know uh, there's one fish in there or there is like again like a big one meter clam or something right there's no logic behind it and that's that's actually um yeah, we go on with, it's always scientific work behind it. That's, that's what Triton is. It's like a kind of thinking that you need to do. And that's, that's yeah, I can't actually say more to it than that. You know. And so that makes it a little easy for the beginner because some test kits can be complicated, well, to them, and they want to, um, they send the water off to you guys. Explain yeah. that process. Yeah, for sure. Like, you know, the, the higher amount of knowledge brings problems, but... Um, which are like you want to ask somebody what to do, right? Um, we set it up a system that, that tells you, you know, what to do when so there is a problem or there is, you know, when you need to dose and stuff that's automatically happening. But um, the easy part of it is, you know, you want to start reef keeping bef and, and, you know, you don't want to sit down two years and read about it. You know what, you, you want to have a tank and it should be a nice tank and that's all right and you learn by doing a bit like and you need to have a safe system for that when you're a beginner right and this is the way to go so we're testing for you we look look after the tank from far away right and tell you look you're doing something wrong so do it better and you by doing it better you learn what you have done wrong and things like that so you you have a nice tank all the time and after two years you have even a better tank because you know what you're doing right that's the way that works for a beginner and people really like it that's a, that's really the way um, to go. It's it's you can do it different, but then you know you actually pain because you don't know, right? Yeah. And that's that's sad, right? We we don't do it like that. Do you um, maybe talk about some of the different products here on the table? Yeah, for sure. So so actually we divide our products in in three to four categories. So we have core chemicals. Core chemicals like the stuff that you need for calcium, magnesium, you know, and alkalinity, which is like the, the core of every reef right um, we have different kinds of of them so we have a very sophisticated super concentrate that nobody else have on the market because we are we produce on our own so it's not like we buy it somewhere we have like a big factory where we can produce that in germany right and then we ship it out to the world we are also doing like sustainable work so you, you know that stuff from milk right and we we actually fill it in that because it's sustainable um, and it's not getting too much plastic and stuff out of the ocean. Then we have, um, we have another category that is supplementation, right? Supplements, trace elements and stuff like that. Um, we have a color code on them. So you can see like core chem is always gray and that's a core chem product, so it's gray, you know, and you have like a, um, like a uh, orange for, for the supplements. And uh, the supplements are like all the trace elements that you add if you need them when the test is saying, then we have treatments and that's like everything that that it, you need to get like something out of the water like you know extraction which is like aluminium 99 aluminium adsorber for phosphate removal like you have um, co3 is alkalinity only 
you know, just raising alkalinity or like um, something very special which is called detox. It's taking just copper out of the water. So you, it's like a knife that cuts out your copper. You don't need to do a water change for that, right, if you have it. Yeah, it's, it's a, like it's a very... Um, it's a very easy but, but wide range of products and they are all tools. So you use them when you need them, right? The same with supplementation or like the base elements. Um, and that's quite cool. I think um, if you want time, you just get, get the chance to go on the website and read through it. It's getting very clear. So it's not too difficult. It's not like super scientific or something. The, the science is behind it. And we hide it as long as somebody is asking for it. Or you come into my talks or something like that. And then people ask. But usability is, is like, you know, very easy to. Very cool. So you can check out more at .de. .de. So uh, thank you so much for talking with me today.